Um, welcome back to uh, Star Citizen. Uh, we're planning to benchmark my 3060 Ti again. 317 this time. 3.17. Um, as I was getting up, as you know, it's Star Citizen. You know, you get what you expect, I guess. But anyways, the reason why I'm doing this video in the first place is because I'm getting rid of my uh, 3060 Ti. So, uh, yeah, but, you know, I'm having some issues right now. Okay, well, I had a force to kill myself. That's a little depressing, but we did it. This is a little outdated, but whatever. What a great flight. I love it. This is so fun. So fun. You know, 45 minutes of this finicky game delaying me from starting this benchmark. Let's go. Oh, and did I mention this will be cut out if I did, but I'm only three subscribers away from 150. So I'd really appreciate if you guys subscribe. I really would. It makes me so happy. You have no idea. I'm so close to that threshold. Anyways, on with the video. So I'm gonna do the same kind of benchmark I did last time. It's where I'm gonna, be, I'm gonna be like, you know, doing it out here on Port All Star or All All Star, whatever. And I'm gonna be looking at the planet, turning off like, you know, changing like settings in the obviously, you know, because this is a benchmark, but for different settings, I guess, with a 3060 T 3060 Ti. And um, I will also be, um, you know looking changing the clouds mostly because that's the actually the hardest hitter for this game is the clouds so you know i want to see how it, it changed since the update i haven't really had a chance to check that out i know i know you're impressed with my landing skills i am just that good i'm just that good so the FPS is dramatically increased from um, when you're out out in space. Like looking over here, dang, we're in six. This is 60 FPS gameplay with a 3060 Ti. That's amazing. I, you know, like we got 69 for a second there. Obviously, look at the planet and your FPS just goes poo poo. But dang. Okay, so let's start this, guys. So we're going to do very high for everything. So we're going to do very high voltmet voltmetric volume volumetric. That's the word. Volumetric clouds to very high. Have everything high. No motion blur cuz okay. You know, if you, if if you're that, you know, desperate for FPS, you know, it's, it's just, oof. Sharpening 100%, you know, all, all these, everything's the max. I, I, I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty positive. Yeah, everything's at max 1440p. I don't got 4K, and I don't think this will be very good for 4K. So, well, let's let's check out the holy crap. Yeah, so you know, over here. <laughs> <sighs> It's the same FPS looking away. It's just the, the cloud. Like this game looks so good. Like holy crap! Obviously, you look really, really close. Textures are kind of iffy. Look at your ship though. Textures can look really nice. Like dang. But you look at the planet. The clouds look so good compared to medium. Like holy crap! Look at those clouds. I look like I'm. It feels like I'm looking at Jupiter, but 20 FPS. That's not playable. It's not playable in the slightest. And this is the reason why this is the most demanding, um, well, the most demanding area I know is because, well, this planet is literally made of the setting that, you know, hits the PCs in the knees the hardest with the crowbar, you know. It's clouds, volumetric clouds. So, you know, really great, you know. Really great. So, what I would suggest, if you want, if you want clouds, to do, maybe let's see what high is before you medium. Uh, so you might not be able to tell, 
but if it's a little bit more grainy but like only slightly and you get double the fps and then i'm guessing maybe maybe high is the way to go because i don't maybe maybe medium is actually really not that great that's about three more FPS and it's noticeably not like too bad. Like it's not bad at all, but it's noticeably more grainy. So, you know, you do you, but I think high is the way to go, but I'm going to show you guys it with off. I'm guessing we're going to do. Oh my, see, that's the problem. You know, you, you can really want high FPS, like really high FPS um, gaming. Like, holy crap. Imagine playing Star Citizen on a 3060 Ti at 1440p with like 80 FPS, but you get that. That's that's what you get. So I'd recommend not touching. I mean, keeping it on medium at the minimum. But honestly, high isn't too bad. High is not bad at all. You know, very high is. I think it just cripples your PC too much. You might want like a 3080 or something like that if you're gonna do really high but 40 fps while you know looking at this one planet because i said i believe most plants are going to be just fine compared to um I'm, I'm brain dead i am brain dead i am brain dead give me give me a mills we're at crusader yes most plants are going to be far less demanding than crusader and you know, look at this, S you know, high 70s while not having clouds. I'm guessing on most planets you'll have 60 FPS, maybe. Maybe like, you know, definitely above 50, because if you th you're getting 40s in this, yeah, you're definitely gonna be fine. Definitely playable, definitely enjoyable. Now, if you wanna know how much you can get max FPS, I'm doing this just in 1440p, by the way. This t you know, scaling the resolution doesn't do much in Star Citizen. It's not. It's not optimized that way. It's not. It's not optimized very good in, in any way. But we're gonna go low everything. Low everything. Let's get a hundred FPS. No, just nineties. Yeah, no, it's not worth it. It isn't. And but the thing is, even low texture. It doesn't look bad. Like, it doesn't. I can't even really tell a difference. That's the problem. No, I mean, not that much of a difference. It's like, it's just, yeah, it's just slightly less sharp. That's all it is. You know, a solid 80 FPS experience pretty much everywhere, I would guess. Definitely, like, 60 plus no matter what. But, oh, shoot. I have no idea what, oh. I just did the never mind. So yeah, you know, that's how if you really, really need the FPS and you're on a different GPU of course, because you don't need to do it for this GPU, you know. But I would say very high. It's just fine. It's not that very high. Everything very high except for fall metric clouds, which you can do high for, which will make you very happy. These do not change anything. I did it in my last Actually, I've done multiple um, uh, benchmarks with my 3060 Ti in this game, and the only ones that really affected it was quality and volumetric clouds. And honestly, th like 50, like 45 FPS for that beauty is totally worth it. Anyways, um. I don't know how long this video is. It might not be 8 minutes. It might be 15 minutes. Because, you know, I've been recording for a while now. And I've only gotten a, a little bit of recording um, uh, content, I guess you could say. But dang, is this game just beautiful. It's so good. Anyways. I'll see you guys in the next one. Maybe you can uh, help me out by getting me to 150 if you really, really want to be nice. But I'm not going to force you. Okay. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Okay, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.